Smart Tea Factory. The tea leaves at Benchmark Tea Estates are plucked and manufactured with utmost care and best quality standards are being maintained. We take the pleasure in explaining about the tea manufacturing process with all details. Tea is an aromatic beverage that is most widely consumed after water by mankind. We explain in this process about the varieties of tea which is made from one single bush called as Camellia sinensis. The types of tea are black tea, CTC and orthodox, green tea, oolong tea, white tea and benchmark. We have three sophisticated manufacturing units where quality tea is manufactured with utmost care and guidance by the master tea makers at Benchmark Uti. We produce green tea, oolong tea and CTC tea. Benchmark Pera. We produce CTC black tea. Benchmark Kunor. We produce black orthodox tea. Tea is a noble herb and a liquid wisdom that contains polyphenols, amino acids, enzymes, pigments, carbohydrates, minerals and volatiles and the botanical name of this herb is called Camellia sinensis. Orthodox tea. The tea leaves were commercially manufactured in India in the year 1830. Since 1830, the orthodox tea met huge demands by the manufacturers in export sales. In orthodox tea manufacture, the green leaf is withered. The withering process is the removal of water content from the green tea leaves and then sent into the rollers where the leaves are crushed. Post crushing, the rolled and unrolled tea leaves are separated that are called as first fine and second fine. After the rolling process, the tea leaves are placed on the ceramic tiles for fermentation. During the fermentation process, the color, flavor, liquor and taste is enhanced due to the activation of enzymes. Further, fermentation process takes place for 90 minutes at room temperature of 21 degrees Celsius. Then, the tea leaves are dried at 110 degrees Celsius and sent to the fiber extractor that works on static electricity where the fiber and stalks are removed. Following the fiber extractor process, the leaves are sorted into shapes and sizes accordingly. CTC Black Tea This tea came into existence after the year 1930 and was first started in Assam. The tea became popular throughout all the tea growing company states shortly. CTC means crush, tear and curl. First process in CTC tea manufacture is the withering. Post withering, the tea leaves are sent into rotor van for crushing and further passed into five cut machines between two high speed stainless steel sharpened rollers and finally crushed leaves are sent into the fermentation drum where shapes are formed and at CFM the tea is oxidized. The tea leaves are oxidized or fermented according to the room temperature and after fermentation it is dried at 135 degrees Celsius. Once the leaves are dried it is sent into fiber mat where the fiber and flaky tea is sorted through static electricity and further sorted to its shapes and sizes. Finally, they are packed into an airtight container to maintain the goodness of the tea. Green tea processing. Green tea is often referred to as unoxidized tea. The initial step of green tea manufacture is activating the enzymes of the plucked green leaf through steaming which applies slight heat to the tea leaf controlling oxidation process. The second process is the green leaf being crushed and dried as it gains high moisture content in the process. The tea leaves are rolled twice and dried twice, post which the stalk and flaky tea leaves are removed and packed. If you're a health or fitness enthusiast, green tea 
will be a great gift to you as it contains a caption called Epigallo caption EGCG which is a natural antioxidant that helps in preventing cell damage and have other benefits. These substances can reduce the formation of free radicals in the body that protects cells and molecules. Oolong tea. The initial process of Oolong tea manufacture is withering and then the leaves are steamed by passing light heat. Post steaming, the tea leaves are rolled, fermented and dried at 110 degrees Celsius. If you would like green tea to taste bitter the app option, you can go for Oolong tea which gives a typical floral taste that contains partial goodness of green tea. White tea. The young levels with fine white hair are called as white tea. These are unfolded leaves from the newest growth of tea leaf in a plant. White tea is the minimally oxidized variety of tea and contains less caffeine compared to the other varieties. It was only the emperor's drink in China because of its delicate, rare and beautiful aroma. White tea is plucked and sun dried with utmost care and passion. It contains a higher number of antioxidants. However, the green tea proves its superiority with regards to 